G'day, welcome back to another video. In this video, we'll be running this little mini T. This is one of the original ones. You might have saw one of my recent videos where I got this going again. I'll leave a video up the top there. Yeah, so we're gonna run it brushed and we've got the little uh, 2S uh, lithium ion battery in it. Didn't go with lithium polymer, just lithium ion. I had it sitting there, so we'll run it. <laughs> Was also a good chance to try out one of my, uh, well, both of my new jumps that I built the other day, um, or the other week. Uh, I'll leave a video up, up the top for that too. <laughs> So this one's got the brush motor it came with. It's not an original motor, it is a modified motor, but it's only brushed. I haven't taken it out, so I don't know what it is. <laughs> um, but yeah, we'll give it a go, see how she runs. So I just started cruising back and forward kind of float out <laughs> see how quick it is and it is a quick little beast even with a, just a brush motor it does little wheelies on carpet and that but not so much on the concrete but uh, with a brushless motor it'd be doing wheelies everywhere probably uncontrollable so I figure I'd just you know run up and down before I get the jump out So after a little warm up, it was time to get some markers out. See if I can drive. <laughs> yeah, not very well. I think I did better the second time around. That's it, much better. Yeah, that was my foot. <laughs> then it was time to get one of my new jumps out. So I just do a bit of a warm up on the lowest setting on the ramp. Missed that one, of course. Always the way. <laughs> but I figure I'll leave it on the low setting and uh, yeah, just have a few goes and then uh, put it up higher or get another ramp out, whatever. Alrighty, enough of that, let's get the other ramp out. Yeah, I was a bit worried about hitting the ramp. As you can see, that's not really an issue. Um, had to keep moving them apart. After each jump, just move them apart. A little bit at a time. And uh, yeah, kind of went a bit bad at the end. <laughs> As you can see, it still clears the second ramp pretty much every time, so I just keep moving them apart. <laughs> and I probably didn't use enough throttle on this run. <laughs> oh. Still clearing the second ramp, so I thought I'd put the, uh, the run-up ramp on the higher setting which is kind of medium for that ramp. 
I think that's a bit over the limit for the uh, Mini T. It's not very graceful on the higher setting. <laughs> Tends to roll. And then it went bad from there. The left rear wheel hit the concrete and broke the rear hub. And there's our axle right there. <laughs> So that's it, it's all over for today, gotta to fix it, lucky I've got a few spare hubs. Alrighty, so I've got the rear hub off there, as you can see it's broken on the top. So I've got this Alloy Trinity one, that's how it should look. <laughs> so I'm going to swap it to those. Good thing I've got a few spares, I've got another set after that. <laughs> they shouldn't break though, they should be good. And yeah, check out the size of those tiny E-clips. There we go, got them both off. And since they had plastic bushes in, it was a good time to put bearings in the hubs. So there they are. They look pretty sweet, I reckon. Might have preferred them in blue or maybe silver. <laughs> now a real lifesaver was this dynamite E-ring tool, or E-clip tool, whatever you want to call it. You slip the E-rings in the end and clip them on. They come in every size from 1.5 up to 5mm. Very handy tool. So, that's it. She's all fixed now. You can see the little hubs in there. Little red ones. <laughs> I thought, ah, oh, putting red on blue ones, eh, it's going to be a bit ugly, but you can barely even see them, so it's all good. <laughs> So I think it went pretty good, um, you know, certainly for a brush motor it went pretty well. Didn't mono a lot, uh, I actually drove it earlier inside on carpet and it, it monos quite a bit. Um, on the concrete, not so much. But yeah, I'm pretty happy with it. Uh, I did notice having the jump on higher levels isn't very good for it. The jump about that high is probably about its limit. <laughs> but yeah, overall I'm pretty happy with it. So in the next couple of days I'll probably uh, do some unboxings and run the other little Mini T's, the, the Mini T2's, I've got a couple of them, three of them now I think. <laughs> so I'll get onto them and give them some runs, that should be good. Alrighty, well if you enjoyed the video give it a thumb up, if you're new here subscribe, that'd be awesome. Plenty more stuff to come, more Losey gear on the way, and uh, yeah, catch you later.